Hi friends, this is just an update on the strawberry project. The rest of the strawberries, the ones that I didn't freeze, I sliced them up and I put them on these trays so I can dry them out here in the dehydrator. And then I'll have them, this thing's got a little fan and a heater in it and it blows air through them all and then they dry out real nice. So hang on while I put it together. Then all the trays stack up on here and they kind of go like this and then you got to put the lid on it here I can do this one-handed well I'm getting pretty good at this except the cord stuck in there <laughs> okay well let me power it up here so hang on again here the fan running now and it'll blow hot air out here and blow it through there and then by tomorrow morning I'll have a whole bunch of strawberry chips maybe all get freeze dried or, or not freeze dried but air dried and then I can use them in cereal or probably just eat them plain if you wanted to so just another way of preserving the strawberries so thanks for watching I'll see how this turns out well here's the moment we've been waiting for Strawberry shortcake with whipped cream on it. I even got some extra ones here. A couple more here, and then Bear thinks this is something he should have. <laughs> well, that's probably not going to happen, is it, Bear? You have to wait for your birthday cake. Yeah, we're going to make that pretty soon. So, okay, well, I ought to turn my dehydrator back on here and finish drying the rest of them. Well, they got a ways to go here yet, so hang on for a while. Well, friends, this has been taking a while. That strawberry shortcake sure was good. After I ate that all down, then I've been sitting here waiting and waiting for them to get done. So I did some, played a little few board games here with my monkey friends, but they keep cheating. And But I noticed something happened here. I don't know why, but the lid is moving around. Well, as they must be done by now, we'll probably take a look. Oh man, <laughs> I forgot to make sure there weren't any spiders in those berries. I want to put them in here now. What happened? Oh darn it, they ate up all my strawberries. I think I'm, I don't know if I want to touch that guy. So I'll oh, hang on a minute while I get a bucket or something to put him in. Well, friends, the spiders didn't actually eat them all up. This is what they really turned out like. <laughs> <laughs> They've been drying in here for oh probably five six hours. I don't know so it's been a while So I actually have been playing board games here But the it's hard to play with those monkeys because I'll tell you they keep moving parts and throwing cards around and It seems to me that the monkeys always win like this one here. Uh, I don't know So anyhow these turned out pretty good so I've got to get them all out of here and put them on a in a bowl here then I'll show you what that looks like well I got all the strawberry chips out of the dehydrator now don't know what I'm gonna do about that spider <laughs> I think he likes those sweet berries but they made up some really nice chips here they're real dry like potato chips and they taste really good they're like all the sweetness concentrated into this so a person could put them in your cereal and your oatmeal or just eat them plain like a snack um, it takes a little time to do it this way but then there's no preservatives and you can put them in a Ziploc baggie and have them right in the cabinet ready to use whenever you want them. I mean I've done potatoes and tomatoes and peppers and mushrooms all kinds of things this way so you can make some real good soup mixes and everything else. So but but you gotta watch out for those spiders and monkeys they sure are a problem. <laughs> Thanks for watching my video. Hope everybody's having a good day.